Welcome to part 68 of the Real Ghostbusters Paranormal 100 Baby Challenge. And then in this episode, um, Ray gets a new girlfriend and then goes ghostbusting. That's pretty much what we're doing in this entire episode. So, this new girlfriend is Ava... Capricosa. Ava Capricosa. Welcome to being Ray's new baby mama. <laughs> because when, his, when you finally reach this true love, I, it feels like she's cheating. You know? <laughs> this guy, this is before he meets this true love, okay? But this is part of the challenge. You, it all, this is just part of the Ray doesn't like the part, the, the part that he has to use use women, but he, he's doing it anyway. I don't know if this makes him a bad person or not. It doesn't seem to. I mean, he's got the the they have a scale where it measures if you're uh, good or have a good or a bad reputation. If, he, if this was bad, I, I guess it would be give him a bad reputation, right? <laughs> okay. Um, anyways, I don't know if I mentioned this in the last video. I'm halfway done with Winston. Winston's done. I mean, halfway done. Anyways, but we are just... Um, we... We just, I just finished episode 116. The halfway point was 112. So that's good. I'm on episode, I just got ready to start episode 117. Yep, look at Ray dancing back there. <laughs> he can dance, can he? Yes, he can. <laughs> um. Aww. I was thinking something for a fanfic idea. <sighs> let's do some painting. Yeah, let's do some painting because we gotta give these, these specters something when we convince them to leave. You know, that's how that works. You gotta convince them to leave. Uh, as far as Winston, I'm starting on episode 117 and we're at a house. And it looks like, and I got him on, like, expert paranormal investigation mode. Which means it's the hardest level in, in paranormal investigation. You know, with the red specters. And it looks like the, he's at a house and there's nothing going on. What a freaking grog. Speaking of uh, expert paranormal investigation gig, Ray's got one coming up this episode. <laughs> yeah, he does. Remember how it was getting to where he wasn't finding any ghosts? Well, you'll get to see that eventually. Not yet, but later, like in the second half of Ray, he'll start to see no ghosts anywhere on any place we go. And it isn't sad. What happened to Winston and the... Um, the movie Ghostbusters. With the movie Ghostbusters. Winston. There's hardly any ghosts. It was, I feel like he got. He got. He got shorted on. The job he's supposed to do. You know. And that's happening all over again. It happened with Ray here. And that's going to be happening with Winston. All over again. Here in the second half. Well we're just going to knock on the door. I'm over Winston now. I can play at the same time. There's nothing going on here. Why'd you drag me all the way out here for? There's nothing going on. I'm not kidding. There's nothing going on. Are you freaking serious? Am I gonna spend the whole night here and from 9:30 to 6? So 6.30 in the morning, 9.30 at night to 6.30 in the morning when there's nothing here. Are you freaking serious? There is literally nothing here. Nothing at all. 
What am I doing here then? There's no ghost. There's no spectral activity. Nothing. Nothing. I'm not kidding. There is nothing here. And of course I'm on expert level. This is when you're dealing with you're coming to a lot and there's nothing going on, nothing no paranormal activity. It's easier to do this on expert mode. I mean on a like inept mode, which is the medium level. Because you ain't there that long. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be here all freaking night doing nothing. This is going to be great. I could draw a seance circle and all that stuff. Oh my gosh. She's going to be here all night. She's going to be here all night chasing after... Chasing rainbows, pretty much. <laughs> Uh, per form ceremony, sure. <laughs> this is embarrassing. Winston's better than this. It just happens in in Ghostbusters. I mean, it happens when people thought they had a paranormal experience when they're really not. It's all in their head. It's happened before. It's happened in the real Ghostbusters. I mean, sure. The ghost person get called on a mission and there's really nothing going on. It's just someone's imagination. It happens. But too much. He's going to be here all freaking night. And it's going to suck. It's going to suck so bad here. Oh. My gosh. You know. You know what you can do. You can do some fishing. He doesn't have, have nowhere to fish where he's at. I mean, there's really nothing going on here. We're going to make it look like we got, we got something going on. You know, having temperance show up will actually be helpful right about now. Because she can cause things, things to just pop up out of nowhere. She can cause some paranormal activity. We need that. We need that right now. I mean, as much as we're doing the seances and stuff, Temperance will have no problem showing up. Where is Temperance when you need her? I like the Temperance ghost. Sometimes she's annoying, sometimes she's very helpful. In this case, she'd be very helpful. You know what? Let's do some fishing. Why not? He doesn't have a fishing skill. I mean, why not? You can't go fishing in the apartments. So this will be useful. And he can stop every once in a while to take care of some stuff that's just popping up. That's fine. Where are we at with Ray? We're we're talking to some red ghosts. This is a red little specter. So I like to have to get so happy and disappear. <laughs> this is so cute. You can't how are you scared by this? This is just so cute. I remember Ray or Winston going on a job and And there's nothing going on. I mean, okay, that's it. I'm pause. Um, I'm ending the video clip right there. Hopefully, he, he. Where was Temperance when I needed her? When I needed that ghost, the evil ghost. What happened? I needed that right now. Hopefully, it doesn't glitch out and we get to go home at six thirty. Gig failed though. What am I supposed to do? This, this career is a glitch. <laughs> but I have to make a series. You know when I said I was going to do uh, uh, Rags to Riches with ghost busting? <laughs> like they used the money for ghost busting to build their uh, firehouse. Until they fix this, I'm not doing that. <laughs> for now, it is what it is. I'll save my game here. Go back to Ray. Like I said, I remember either it was with Ray or Winston. I think it was with Winston. One of 
pre-recording now. Winston shows up in a house and a goat and one of the and his, one of the clients were like how do you be so scared of these things? They're so cute. <laughs> these little specters are so cute. I think their faces are so cute. Yeah. You'll get to see that when you when we do get over to Winston. But for now, we're on Ray. We gotta get through Ray. Three weeks of Ray. We should be fine. I know I said I was going to take a break in September, but you know, I still want to do the um, Cottage of Living Let's Play as well. We'll just, maybe I could just do some record, some pre-recording and upload them later, like in October or something. Yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be pre-recording, and it'll be all be ready to go, you know? By the time October rolls around, I've got them ready to be uploaded. I also got a couple builds. I didn't make, make the templates that I was going to be using for the builds. So the templates are ready to go. I just need the world to put them in. I had to save. I, had, I didn't have the templates. I had to make the templates in order to, like, in order to save them to my gallery. And then once I get the cottage living, I mean, I could start working on some builds. I just got a cookie jar. Cool, or a candy jar. It's actually a candy jar. I was going to say, I keep saying cookie jar. Because that's what it might be. If anyone isn't sure what these jars do, I think Peter demonstrated what these, what these candy jars do. If you get a candy from it. They give you energy. That's what they do. We want energy. Grab a spec. Grab a candy from the spectral jar. Okay. That's what they do. And the, those Echo cupcakes. You know what they do? They fill you up for a while. Okay. They keep you full for a while. Um. The soul scraps. They age you down. They they t they turn back the clock for you. Let's say if you're like halfway through the adult stage, it'll take you right back to the beginning. On your current, it's only on your current lifespan. It's like if you're at an elder and you got three days left and you take a soul scrap, eat a soul, absorb a soul scrap, it'll take you right back to the beginning of your elder stage. It depends on what stage you're on. It'll, t it'll take you right back to the beginning of it. That's what the soul scrap does. I guess when you give your soul, part of your soul to a specter, I guess that takes away some of your lifespan. If absorbing one, absorbing a soul scrap gives you life, I guess giving your soul, half of your, some of your soul away takes life away. That's why I'm assuming. I never tried it. I'm just assuming that. There's also the drinks, the specter sips. What that does, that gives you a little bit of skill. That gives you some skill points. That's all that does. Helps you level up on your skills. Not any skill. It's random. If anyone doesn't show up, I never explain. I don't think I ever explain that. I think I explain the soul scrap part. But I never explain the ecto muffins. And I think I wish you could, if you make the ecto muffins, can you make them with the cupcake machine? Can you just make them, or you have to wait till you get them from a specter? Uh, also, the, I think when they when the specters leave you a gift, you give them a gift, they love it, they leave you a gift. If they leave you like something that looks like a voodoo doll, I think that's supposed to keep temperance away if you activate it. I don't know. It only works in your own household. I don't know. What, I don't know about the candles, though. I don't know how that works. I don't know about the candles. I, ha I haven't demonstrated with that. If I did, I don't remember. Oh man, we're gonna be here all night. <laughs> we're here all night. No, no, we're getting ready to leave. We're getting ready to leave. Don't worry, we're getting ready to leave. 
We're checking the place out. There's nothing going on. We're pretty much done here. And now we're home working on skills. What was flickering? Why were the lights flickering? Did you bring some? Did you bring home some PK energy with you, Ray? Did some get absorbed into your uniform? You know that's happened in in the Ghostbusters, in the real Ghostbusters, when they were um, in the episode uh, Citizen Ghost. They were just coming back from a fight with Ghost. They're coming back to the damaged firehouse, and they said they need to change their uniforms because the uniforms they were wearing were loaded with P with with. Uh, Excessive amounts of PKE energy, PKE energy, and that's pretty. That's dangerous. So, and luckily, they had ordered new uniforms, and Janine was like, "Here, and you, here you ordered new uniforms. Here they are." It's like, and Egon's like, "Okay, they'll do for now. We got to get rid of our old uniforms." And Peter, he left Peter in charge of getting rid of them, like burning them or something. And Peter never did. <laughs> oh, Peter Bankman. And then, the, and then they left a crack in the in the new. Uh, they missed a crack when they were repairing the the containment unit, and all. And their old uniforms were right next to it, and they absorbed all the PK energy. Was just, and it made them look like the specters of them of the Ghostbusters themselves. <laughs> and, it, and instead of firing proton beam, proton beams, they're firing PKE energy. And the more they use, they make the ghosts weaker. Wow. And when, that was a good episode. That should have been the pilot episode, to be honest. Yeah, because it explains a lot. It explains how, like, Slimer came to be their pet. <laughs> yeah. Someone said that. Someone said, someone said that Sis and Ghost should have been the very first episode. Should have been the first episode of the real Ghostbusters. But it wasn't. Anyways, I was thinking of that episode, Look Homeward Rain. Season one, and I have an idea for a fanfic with that. Yes, I do. I have a fanfic for that. Yes, when Ray meets someone at the in his hometown, not Elaine. Mm -hmm. Elaine turns out she has a boyfriend. <laughs> she just wants to be friends with Ray. Anyways, that's the end of this episode. Stay tuned for part 69. We got some more ghost busting. And then next two kids will be born. Awesome. <laughs>